Well, hey, how's everyone doing on this fine Sunday morning? Let's see, is it still morning? Yes, it's still morning. It's 1138. <clears throat> Excuse me, you know, I'm always coughing. It's 1138. I just got back from church. This church that I went to, I haven't been to church in, I'm ashamed to say, in a very, very long time. And I've been to different churches here in Marble Falls, but this one so far has been my favorite. It's, I don't even know the name. It's my first time there. I have some friends that go to this church. It's in our old theater downtown on Main Street in Marble Falls. And I must say, the preacher was dynamic. Filled with the Holy Spirit. Young man. Really enjoyed listening to him. And he was talking about Samuel today. And it was just, it was a good sermon. He was quite good. And I would recommend this church pretty much to anybody in Marble Falls. The old theater, don't know the name. Don't even know the name of the preacher. I'm brand new there, but I will be going back next week. At least that would be my plan. Anyways, just want to get on <clears throat> and make a, a video, not just about the church, but is it wrong of me? You know, maybe y'all should pray for me, but I, I like scary stuff. You know, like I like to watch scary movies. Not like gory movies, but like kind of like ghosts or mysteries or, you know, kind of scary stuff. Um, anyways, I thought I would share a true story that happened to me and see what y'all think. Um, I don't know if I, I don't think I believe in ghosts, but I know that demons are real and angels are real. I know that. I totally believe that. And um, anyways, the story I have to tell you, I probably shared it on another video before, but um, I was going through a divorce for my second husband and I had a house out in the country, <clears throat> or we had a house in the country. But I was living there after we split up. And uh, my daughter and I were waiting for a friend to come over. Actually, somebody I was dating at the time. And um, we were watching TV in the bedroom. Sorry, I had to think back on this. And it was my, my daughter was probably around 9 or 10. And we were watching TV waiting for the, the person to arrive. And all of a sudden, I hear my ex-husband screaming loudly as he can he was a very angry person and I could hear him yelling Tammy but I could not after he said Tammy I couldn't tell what he was saying it was like blah 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 so I went running down the hallway my daughter following me and you could hear the rrr, 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 until we got to the living room and it stopped and there was nobody there this really happened so then I went out and I looked outside no car nobody out back nobody and my daughter was like, what's going on, mom? And I was like, you know, I don't know. It's really weird. So I said, nah, just forget it and let's go on to back to the bedroom and watch TV. So we went back. About five minutes later, it happened again. Tammy, <laughs> just, I mean, it was exactly, the voice was definitely my ex, her dad. And we both took off running and I'm screaming, what are you doing in here? How dare you come in the house? I'm screaming as I'm running down the hall. And then it stopped as soon as we got to the living room again. Kid you not, true story. That was the end of that though. And he wasn't there. I. Uh, what do you guys think? Do you think can like voices get trapped in the walls from like, so much yelling all the time, kind of like a tape recorder, you know, picks up the voice, the sounds. Um, did it get caught on two by fours in the walls? I mean, or was it something else? Was it his anger towards me coming through? I don't know. What do y'all think? Give me your info back on, do you think, because I'm telling you, this is a true story. This really happened. Um, it happened. And my, I wish my daughter was here to verify it. But if she sees this video, she'll probably, she'll, she'll probably say, yes, it's true. It really happened. If, I don't think she even watches my videos. But anyways, just wanted to do a video about that. Get to church if you haven't been. If you don't know Jesus, come to know him. Love you all. Thanks for watching this, taking your time to watch it. And if you haven't subscribed, please do. And if you liked it, give me a thumbs up. And I'd love to hear back from you. 
Let me know what you think about that story. It was crazy. And another thing that happened is my daughter told him about it. And he said he heard me yelling at him this, at his house. I don't know if I believe that. Just too weird. Anyways, let me know what you think. God bless each and every one of you. Have a great night. Have a great Sunday. Love y'all. Bye-bye for now.